Hey guys, this is Fury91, and Microsoft had a partner showcase recently, and I'm not going to talk about the individual games and stuff like that, but there's one thing I want to point out. See, underneath they said, like, what it was coming to, and none of them, I believe, are actually coming to Xbox Game Pass. Now, I just want to point that out. Xbox Game Pass has really changed the game, in a sense, because look at all these third parties that are coming. It's not just Microsoft games. It's actual of games from their partners as well. I know I'm saying game a lot, but it is. Because here's the thing about Game Pass, and I've experienced this. If you're one of those people who own two consoles, I own the Xbox Series X and the Nintendo Switch. Or if you're a PC gamer who also has maybe a Nintendo Switch or a PS5. And then these third-party games come out on Game Pass. You may have been like, I want this game. I may have gotten it for the PS5 or the Nintendo Switch, depending on which other console you have. But since it's free on Game Pass, I might as well get it on Game Pass. And that's what happened to me with Bug Fables, actually. Bug Fables was... I probably would have gotten it for the Switch, but because it was free on Game Pass, I got it on Game Pass. Same thing probably with Activision. See, Microsoft doesn't actually have to make certain games from Activision exclusive. They don't. They just have to have them first day on Game Pass. And a lot of people may be like... Especially the people who play mostly Call of Duty and stuff like that. They may be like, you know what? I'm just going to get Game Pass. Why would I buy it for the PlayStation or anything like that? I'm just going to get Game Pass. Because if you have both Microsoft games and third-party games on Game Pass, and you may only have to buy a few games that you want extra, then a lot of people, I think, even people who don't own Microsoft's console, maybe PC gamers, or even those people who are playing it through xCloud, may just be like, well, yeah, I'm just going to get it on Game Pass. So kudos to Microsoft, because y'all really got behind Game Pass and pushed and pushed and kept on pushing. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you all.